I'm Arielle Tolke and I'm a makeup artist in Local 798 and I work on film and television. There's a lot of actors that have a hard time crying when prompted. Uh, some actors are really good at crying on cue and some actors need a little bit of help. So we employ one method, two methods, sometimes a lot of different methods to sort of get them to where they need to be visually for the scene. I am ready to cry. <laughs> I am always ready to cry. I feel like sometimes in a lot of comedy, you know, to be like one tear, getting you going and running in with an eye drop, you know, you're just standing right off a camera and you can just run into that one drop and, you know, get it right before they, they roll. Like, you know, so yes, of course, there's a benefit to that. In addition to the actor's natural tears, we might use like a Vaseline-based product in order for it to look like there's been a lot of crying. Sometimes, even if an actor's getting there, sometimes this helps them get there faster. Any artist will always have some sort of Vaseline-based product in their kit, whether it's, you know, like Aquaphor or some sort of clear gloss. Then there's the two menthol applications. One is the Krylon Tear Stick, which looks like a lipstick with menthol in it, and that's applied under the eyes. And that also is like a little bit kind of shiny, so it sort of does do that little bit of a double duty that a Vaseline-based product will. With either of the menthol products, do not get that directly in somebody's eye. Nobody's gonna like lose an eye over it, but uh, it's definitely very uncomfortable. So using the Tear Stick, you wanna be careful when applying it that you get it close, but not in the eye, and that um, your actor doesn't rub their eye. Okay, yep, here it comes. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Try to keep your eyes open. And then there's the blower, which um, you literally blow or menthol air into somebody's eye. Oh, yeah, now there it is. Okay. Which, totally irritates your eyes and the benefit to using the menthol versions is that because it's literally irritating the eye, the eye will get red. So if you've ever seen yourself after you've cried, your eyes are puffy and red, it's because you're sort of like irritating and rubbing your eye and so that menthol application does that to your actor. That you always want to blow it into your hand first and make sure that the cotton is there and it didn't move. I've heard horror stories where, oh, I didn't know, you know, somebody borrowed it and then the blue menthol crystals in somebody's eye and then you, nobody wants that. That would just be, you know, you've, you've completely ruined the scene for everybody. <laughs> My eyesight's so bad, I have it, I have it like really oh, close God. to my face. <laughs> and that makes me really 